How to choose a camera. Cameras come in many different varieties, shapes, colors, levels of quality, and of course, prices. Some people buy all their devices based on the price, which they interpret to mean quality. Others want to get a bargain and so spend much time researching and deciding on the perfect camera. These two types of people are also wanting a camera that will last, take magnificent pictures, and has many bells and whistles as possible. These days, the quality of the picture you can take on your cell phone is usually excellent. Many people have found that their cell phone pictures are perfect for putting online and sending to others. But if you occasionally want a better image quality, you might want to purchase a point-and-shoot camera. You will definitely get a better picture, but the question becomes are those advantages worth the extra money it will cost to get them? A point-and-shoot is easy to use, cheap, and great for those just beginning in the photography world. These cameras are easy to use, but can take great photos. On the other hand, cell phones and smartphones have gotten better and better over the years in many ways. The cameras that included with your cell phone are a good example of this. If you only want to carry one device around, if you're generally taking pictures of friends and family, if you're more interested in the moment and not the technical side of photography, and if you just don't have the money for a dedicated camera, your cell phone camera will be a handy device. If you're interested in a small camera that is also a pen, scoot on over to www.runsamazingproducts.com. Now that's a handy camera.